everyone, I'm Isabel and welcome to Grace Kids Online and the adventure of following Jesus. We are so excited that you have joined us today and we want to say a big welcome to all of those that are joining us for the first time. We've got a message for you, but before we start, we've got some awesome people we would like to celebrate. And those people are the ones that had their birthdays. If you have had a birthday recently, we would like to say happy birthday to you. We pray that God will bless you, He will shine His face upon you, and that He will guide you every day of your life. So a wonderful, wonderful happy birthday to you all. We are on our last Sunday of our series called I Spy, and we have been discovering that Jesus loves everyone, and that you and me can believe in Jesus. We heard last week how Paul, one of Jesus' followers, was telling everyone about Jesus. And that Jesus always tells us the truth. Let us go now and join Ollie at the Wonder Clubhouse. They are all the way from America. They are going to be singing to Jesus and they're going to be telling us another story about how Jesus loves us. I'll see you later. That should do it. Oh, hey everyone, I'm Manny and I did the coolest thing today. I went to the eye doctor. Can you tell me what this picture is? It was 
easy to see the pictures at the top of the chart, but the teeny ones at the bottom, those were harder. It was so much fun that I made my own eye chart to practice. Let's put it on the wall. Now you can practice with me too. Here's the fun part. You have to cover up one eye. Take your hand like this and cover up one eye. And hold it right there. Ready? I spy with my little eye something that is green and brown and has branches. It's a tree! You spotted it! Now let's test your other eye. Take your other hand like this and cover up your other eye and hold it right there. Ready? I spy with my little eye something that is red and means love. A heart! You did it! You spotted something on the smallest row. Great work! Ho, ho. Hey, it's Ollie! Hello, Manny. Ho, ho. Testing your vision, are you? Hi, Ollie. Sure am. I made my own eye chart to practice seeing. That's a fun thing to do. But I've got something even better to spy. It's true. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Ho, ho. Follow me through. Aisha and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Check out today's special. Ta-da! I call them taste like heaven because each bite is the best thing ever. <laughs> Which is exactly the true story I want to tell you today. Get your I spy eyes ready so you can help me tell the story. Awesome! If you're ready for a story on the count of three, yell tell me a story. One, Two, three, tell me a story. Raise your hand if you have ever heard about a place called heaven. Great, that is what our story is about today. A very special place called heaven. One day, Jesus was with his friends, the disciples. He told them he would be going away soon. He said he was going to a special place called heaven to get everything ready for all of the people who believed in him. He said this place was very big and it had a lot of rooms. Later, after Jesus died and came back, he visited many of his friends. Jesus wanted his friends to see that he was alive with their very own eyes. Jesus talked with them and ate food with them so they would see he is alive and believe in him. Do you see Jesus alive? Help me look for him. I spy with my little eye. Jesus is alive! While Jesus was talking and eating with his friends, he told them to go and tell everyone that he is alive and he wants to be their friend forever. Then something amazing happened. After Jesus finished talking to his friends, he went straight up into the sky through the clouds and into heaven. All of his friends saw him do it with their very own eyes. Can you see a sky with clouds? Look with me. I spy with my little eye. A sky with clouds! <laughs> While Jesus' friends were standing there looking at the sky, two angels came and asked them, Why are you looking at the sky? Jesus has gone to heaven, but he'll be back. Wow! We know heaven is real because Jesus told us it is real. And we can believe Jesus because he always tells the truth. And everyone who believes in Jesus will get to be his friend forever and live with him in heaven one day. Can you see why this is one of my favorite true stories from the Bible? And Jesus is getting a place in heaven ready for everyone who believes in him. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up! Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can believe in Jesus? I can believe in Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye! 
So there's your story. And it's all true. Jesus has a special place with him in heaven. For me and for you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow. Jesus wants to be our friend forever. He's even made a special place for us in heaven one day. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you just like got it, get it? Good. I love spying fun things on my eye chart, but the most amazing thing to spy on is this, my Bible. Because the Bible teaches us that Jesus wants to be our friend forever. He's even made a special place for us in heaven one day. See you guys next time. Bye. I spy with my little eye. written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. John 20, 31. These are written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. John 20, 31. Wow, what a story. Jesus has a place for everyone in heaven who believes in him. I can't wait to see my place in heaven because I believe in Jesus. Let us talk to Jesus together. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for being my forever friend. Thank you, Jesus, that you've got us a special place in heaven. For all of those of us who believe in you and trust in you, we thank you for that in Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks for watching today, boys and girls. You will see after this an activity will come up so that you can remember the message you heard today. You can also ask your moms and dads to take it to church to pick up your activity packs and everything will be inside these packs for you to do. Have fun. And moms and dads, don't forget to catch our Faith at Home video. And if you have joined us for the very first time, I want to say welcome. I, we would love to connect with you and if you could just pop us an email and the email address will come up below and I would also like to ask you that if you've enjoyed today's message please go click like share and subscribe Ooh, I can spy my favorite toy Yay! bye guys I'll see you next week it's activity time you will need the week 4 worksheet that you can find in your activity pack if you are able to pick it up from your campus. Or you can ask your moms and dads to go on our Facebook group and print it out for you. You will also need the piece of colored A4 paper, the piece of green A5 paper, some crayons, scissors, glue and some cotton wool. Color in the pictures on the template. Cut the pieces out. Cut a wavy hill shape out of the green A5 paper and stick it onto the blue A4 page. Glue the clouds and Jesus onto the blue-green page and glue the cotton wool onto the clouds. Have fun!